Today I'm going to talk about the Panda clothes dryer. Perfect for anyone who does not have a dryer at home or if you live in an apartment and you haven't had a hookup for a washer or a dryer. So here's the user instructions, the manual. Comes with the leg. There should be three legs. So there's three legs. The main poles. And I'm trying to figure out what this is. The folding clothes rack. Heater itself, the top, and you get the bag that goes over it. So I'm going to assemble this and then I will show you exactly um, how it works. It has the blue cap. And you can basically screw them both in at the same time, it doesn't matter. I'm going to screw the base in. And then we're going to screw the clothes rack. So basically, you're just, there's no tools required. You're just screwing everything in on the top. Except the one for the folding clothes rack, it just sits on top. You just push it down. It's much taller than I thought. Okay. And then you're going to hang the insulation tube cover over the folding rack. It says you can set the timer from 30 to 180 minutes. Let's see if I can see where the timer is. Yes. 30 to 180 minutes. I'll just show you that. Easy to plug in with the electrical cord. Um, when you switch it on, the machine is always working, so always make sure you turn it off, as it is set to off right now. And it, as you can see, it's a pretty, um, it's a pretty tall, it's a pretty tall dryer, and it's approximately, almost, Okay, so here it is fully assembled. I have some wet jeans on. I'm going to stick this insulation bag over it and I'm going to turn it on and see how long approximately. Here is the Panda clothes dryer with the insulation bag on top and as you can see my clothes are inside. And just and as you can see it's plugged in so now I'm going to turn it on. I have no You just turn it to whatever timer you want. I'm going to set this to 60 minutes. Here, it's very quiet. 